Good morning. How you guys doing? So um, it's a beautiful morning and once again, so we've been blessed and we're just going to take full advantage of it. So as long as the weather allows, I'm just going to be out here on my front porch and you're all invited to my party. So let's get our rip sticks, whatever you need to use. If you don't have anything, that's fine. Towel. And uh, if you're thirsty, if you like to drink water while you're working out, grab your water as well. I have a mat as well because I don't have carpet out here. So uh, I got my little sweatshirt on because it's just a little bit chilly, but that will come off as I heat up. So let's get started. Can somebody let me know that they can hear me in the chat boxes? I just want to make sure. Been having some technical difficulties. So I'll keep my eye out for that. All right, guys, let's party. Ain't no sunshine when yeah. she's gone. Yeah. It's not warm when she's away. Yeah. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Ah. And she's always gone to yeah. Anytime she goes away. Wonder twice. this time where she's gone. Out. thing and she can probably say too this whole it's been challenging us some of us especially like myself getting up in those years Shh, don't say anything about it but anyway so let's hit our next song Now, if you're on a hard surface, 
Sometimes it's not clicking. Sometimes it's not clicking. It's going to be that vibration. It's going to cause the key. It's going to be on this side. So you don't have to hit. But you want to get close. That's giving up the name. Because the more we do this, the better we get to it. Cool. already done this before but repetition gets you to be really proficient at what you're doing so that you can maximize your workout so it's perfectly okay that we've already done this before so no sense in giving you something you're trying to learn it and I change it up on you okay so this is that position back okay arms go straight back you're working those Triceps, pressing it back, back is flat, knees are soft, you're hitched to the hips. Back, take that leg out to the side, back, switching off. All right, here we go. Love the Apple Watch. What you say? Don't come back no more. All right, one arm. Remember, nice and long. Working that back. Hot time. Bring it out. Point that toe. Here we go. Can't get the floor, that's fine. Go over. Big arm swing. Yeah. Make it big, guys. Here we go. Get slow. Get your chest. Put your take out the legs, right? Over. If you need a break, just bring it up a little bit. I still want you to be down a little bit with those legs. Double tap. Good opportunity to 
fire up your quads right now. Okay? Don't want to come down that well? Just come down a little bit. Right? That's enough to get those muscles engaged from the top. No more, no more, no more, no more. Don't come back no more. What you say? Oh, you heard me. Hit the road, Jack. There we go. Whoa. Give me a little hop. Hey. I know you all hop with me. I'm proud of you. Lift. Remember, you have levels. I do want you to lift that leg, okay? Woo! Knees are soft. Light hands to the hips. Give clearance to the leg. Here we go. Pull it. Come on. Keep going. Give me all you've got. Take it to the end. That's it. All right. I know you did a fantastic job at home. I could hear your rib sticks from all the way over here. All right. We're going to move to the next one. All right. We get to come down. So, yay. Give your legs a break. Do more for the core, right? Okay. So, come down on your mat. I'm going to move mine forward just a little bit so I'm not so far away from you. All right. I want you to be able to hear me. Okay. So, remember, love your back. Okay. I'm going to turn to the side. Again, just as a reminder, don't do this, okay? Even if you go forward, you don't want to hunch at the back, okay? It's still a hip hinge, right? It's not a hunch over rolling over to the front. Folding at the hips, okay? Keep that chest up. Try to remember that. Keep that up. Don't look down. Look forward, okay? 45 degrees for what you do. Side to side, punching, the arm goes across one arm at a time, okay? So, side to side, knees can come up, balance yourself. If you can't do it, that's fine. Keep the heels down. I'm completely okay with that. I'm more concerned with that rotation and that stress that you're putting on your core muscles, okay? We want those hip flexors to do some work. So, this challenges you a little bit more, gets those lower abdominals really working, but if you don't have it in you and you feel it on your back, keep the heels down. Sit up a little bit higher, okay? You just might not be able to hit as hard or go as fast. That's okay. Go through the motions. All right, guys. Enough of that. We're going to take it off. It's done. Woo! So notice I'm not doing a full body rotation. That's the top. Got rainbow, get the legs. Take your chin, really lift. Just kind of pull that knee towards you, right? Here we go. Side to side. Punch it, cross that arm. Now, knees are right. We're going to swipe it. Slide those heels in and out. Keep that form. Don't punch your back. Side to side. Punch it out, cross over. One arm. Feel that right in your core? We're going back to the leg, reload. Hip flexors are loving you. Oh, they're screaming. 
lovely word to you. To women. Who say, I love you. Like this. If you have it in you, double time. Woo! Bam, bam. Pull them up. Punch it out. There it down. Woo! Stay with it. Woo! Solo, drum solo, big finish. There you go. Nice. Okay, guys. This so next one is the one we're on our back. We're doing all that bridge work. So remember, I want to go through this a little bit again. I want you to put a little more into it if you have not challenged yourself enough, okay? Try it even just one time. That's progress compared to not doing it at all. So we're on our back. Here's where we have those legs up in the air. One stick is behind you, okay? You can tap the floor or not. You're just bending the elbow, okay? The other arm's going to be down. This leg is going to follow suit with this leg. Well, this one's up. Okay? Now, in order to get that done, squeeze this in. That lower back needs to be flat on the floor. So what I want you to do is think about pulling that belly button in, pressing it into that lower back into the floor to ground yourself. Keep those shoulders down as well. That's why we're not flailing these arms. We're just bending at the elbow, okay? Down, elbow, okay? Shoulders stay down. If you can't do the leg like this, okay? Remember, bicycle the legs. Trust me, you're still going to get that abdominal work done, okay? Boom, boom. All right? That was that first section. The second section... Sticks are up. One stick comes out to the side. You're pulling that back, okay? As that leg taps out to the side, tap it in, and then down. Okay, and I hit my wall, so I'm going to have to move myself back. Okay, down, tap, out, down. Okay, now the way you bump that up and the way it should be done, you're in this bridge position, okay? So, out, a tap, down. Notice my hips are still up, okay? Engaged, fully engaged with the core. This quad is doing a lot of work. This foot is flat on the floor, pressing and stabilizing my body, okay? Out, down. Tap that heel here in the front, okay? If you need a break from it, put your hips down, okay? Go through the work. All right. If you're ready, I'll be waiting. Okay. Come find me. Come find me on my porch. Working out with you. We're doing pounds. Okay. Working off. Nice and controlled. You don't have to open the legs as far. Shorten it up. Okay. Pulse it. Remember, knees to core. Press that back to the floor. Double time. Scissor the legs. Squeeze. Do the best you can. If it's too difficult, like I said, go to those knees. You can do this. Okay? Bicycle the legs a little bit. All right, here we go. Out, leg it down. You might surprise yourself with how well you can get this done. Double, just a pull. 
You don't have to whack it hard. I still want you to be able to control what you're doing. Single. I want you to have control. All right, now. Tap. Pull. Pull. Rock that hip to the side. Now we do the other side. Out. Down. Out. You might find that you're better on one side than the other. Go. Put the hips down. Okay. Double. Pulse it. We want you to feel successful, right? Modify is okay. Perfectly all right. Something for everybody. Single. I'm staying modified. For those of you at home, we can modify. Pull it up. Here we go. Press. Hit. Push it out. Raise it up. See, that wasn't anywhere near as bad as what you thought it was going to be. You're probably actually a lot better at it today than what you were last week. Go team, go. All right. <coughs> Let's bring it back up to our seated position. What we call our kit position. Okay. So we have like a little mini drum set right here in front of us. Virtual drum set we're working on. So, have some fun. Two <laughs> arms swipe to the side. A little bit of a knee raise. You're up. Your step is up. Single rainbows. Now, your hip flexors are probably a little fatigued. That's okay. Stop. But understand why we're doing this. We want the hip flexors to be stronger. Now. Yourself off a little bit, right? 
If you're James Brown, have your entourage come on in and pat you off. Grab your water, get yourself a drink. We're going to move into another one. Throwing in a different one for you. We'll still do the other ones, but just throwing in another one for you. A lot of upper body standing, lunging to the side, reaching, hitting rainbows. So you're going to be hitting to the side and then to the back of your leg. You'll be in the front to the back. When we go fast, you're going to stay in the front. Okay. All right. So remember, that's difficult when you hit the floor. This ends up happening. And then you're doing this. And then you've got this thing going on with your neck, punching in the upper back. Not cool. Okay. So remember, train yourself. The more you strengthen these leg muscles, the further, the further, the further you're going to be able to go as you get used to this. Okay. So progress yourself. Start somewhere and then work on it. Okay. That's the key to success. Never stop trying. All right, guys. Here we go. 
So those legs are straight. In a pyramid position. I'm still squeezing my core. My chest is up. I have a slight hinge at the hip. I want to be able to clear my legs. Pull down. Now, you can start opening up your stance. Pull. If you open up your stance, right? That's the up. Pull. Challenge yourself, guys. I'm sliding. Go with what you got. Now, go for those chucks. There you go. Pull. Working around the clock. Pulling those arms apart. See the up. Think about pulling something apart. Now, start that over. Back to the top. So remember, legs are apart. Slight hinge. Here we go. Open up the body, guys. We don't do that enough. That's why yoga is good. She tried Cory's yoga class. It's amazing. Okay. Challenge your body to do a little bit more than what it's accustomed to. That's what we bring change for, or what change does for the body. Single. Woo! My quad. Fully engaged. Put it flat on the floor. I set that 90 degrees. Hip flexors open on my other leg. Here we go. Chop. Pull. A little bit of a squat there. that intense lunge one so remember when you lunge open this up we're holding a stance so we're not standing and doing an up and down lunge a whole lot where I need to make sure that, that knee goes straight down this is more of an open lunge or so I'm really opening up this hip, hip flexor here this front leg still here supporting me so I can kind of stretch it press up stretch it okay firing up that glute when I press up so that's the position I want you to have for your lunge. And then remember, keep this here. Boom, boom, boom. Hit that glute, hit that gluteus medius, okay? Get you that nice little hump right here at the top. All right, whoop, whoop. Teeth. These are gonna be up, we're gonna do two pulls, tap down. Some okay. days you're the only thing I know. Okay. So the arms come up. Thing that's burning when the nights grow cold. Can't look away, can't look away. Beg you to stay. All right, Beg join you in with me. Hold. Down. Hold. Oh. Stay rules be. apply for that pulling. Push me away, Squeeze those push shoulder me blades. Away. I want it nice and strong. Stay. Raise it up. Here we go. Yeah. Yes. Remember, you're not bending the knee. I want pulses. It's a lift. Give me singles. Here we go. Oh. Wow. My quad really got a lot to say to me today. Down, down, two. Down, cross it. Alright, now. Switch 
looking to the other side. Arms are nice and wide. Down straight. Pull it to the elbows. Now, curl. Left. The more control you have over that, the less pushing off you're going to need. Left. Go for it. Oh, keep it nice and tight. See, not a lot of motion right there. I'm really pressing that foot into the floor. Keeping it nice and tight. Squeezing it off. There we go. Down, down, two, pass. Here, here. Now, pick it up. Inhale, big. Tap it. Bring it down. Up. Down. Walk it over. everybody so let's stretch this out uh thanks for staying with me thanks for staying in it pat yourself on the back for the hard work that you're doing it's amazing you guys are awesome you rock here we go keep my hands on myself other side reach go sit in one hand reach Slide that hand down that leg. If you can touch the floor, great. Just look up towards that hand. Follow the arm up to the tip of the stick. Lift it. Now, I didn't do this last week because of my back. So you saw how I modified that. Put your stick down. Hands on knees. Shoulders. Trying to release that tension and that tightness. Because yes, we use those shoulders today. And go. Legs are straight. You're in that triangle pyramid pose. Reach it up nice and high. Twist it to the other side. You want to get into those hamstrings. So that's why you need to keep those legs as straight as possible. Sit you down on the ground. Shoulders again. Give into that easy living. Goodbye to my hopes and dreams. Stop flipping for my enemy. Now, grab your stick. Now, come up nice and gentle. Keeping that chest up. Keeping that head up. Reaching up. Totally a rebel. Just look at Why not? Now we're going to switch sides. Look, if you don't have the balance, that's why. Keep it right here. Okay? Doesn't matter to me. Take this up. Lean it to the side. Now take that arm. Slide it down. Bring it up. You want to really reach down, but don't do this, guys. That's a forward fold, and I don't want it. Side. I want to stretch this out. Right down that leg. Follow that path. Switch to the other side. Let me kick it like it's and down. 
guys awesome stuff i love it i love it that you keep showing up so you guys really make me proud and uh although we're not right here face to face where i give everybody a big old high five thumbs up circle all that good stuff belly bumps all day long so don't forget use that chat i really want to know who's watching i really you know if you have my number you can text me give you a minute to lisa right on woman Thank you for showing up. But yeah, I want to hear from you because I do miss you just as much as you miss being with us. So um, it's nice to know that you guys are still out there and that you support us as much, much as we want to support you. So have an awesome day. Enjoy the next workout. Justin Tai Chi, great way to calm down after you hiked it up. So I'm telling you, check it out. So he's fantastic. I appreciate you. I love you even more. So have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.